Hey, how are you? I'm good. How are you? I'm fine, thank you. I have just, uh, I have just uh, finished to work, and now I'm back uh, in my home. Oh, wonderful! Um, good timing. Yes, teacher. Uh, can I ask? Uh, can I can I say one thing? Yes, of course. Uh, I wanted to say that uh, uh, my name uh, pronounced uh, Salvatore, uh, no Salvatore, Salvatore. Ah, yes, yeah, Salvatore, because it's yeah. Italian. <laughs> yes, Salvatore. because, because uh, many uh, teachers uh, in Verblin pronounce my name Salvatore. Yes. Uh, uh, I say Salvatore. Well, thank you, thank I you know, for correcting me. No, oh, no problem. Because I know English speaker uh, don't pronounce uh, uh, the vowel uh, right. Yeah. The vowel e. e. Yeah. When, <laughs> when we see that e at the end, we automatically think a silent e. Um, yes. <laughs> yeah, but it's Italian, not English. So Salvatore. Uh, <laughs> great. Thank you so much. Uh, thank you. And and glad you're here also. Welcome. Um, L, hello. L? Oh, she must be having some technical problems. Um, Santiago, hello. And maybe he's having some technical problems, too. Um, well, hopefully they come back. <clears throat> um, and we should have a few more people in class. Um, it wasn't a full class, um, but we should have hopefully four or five people. Uh, Monica, hello. Hello, Stephanie. <laughs> How are you today? I'm good, thank you. Just okay. got off of work. Oh, right great. down to be here. <laughs> <laughs> great, great. Um, and it's Friday, so starting your weekend, you and Salvatore. Yeah. Finally, yes. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> great. Well, hopefully this will be a fun start to your weekend. Thank you. Yeah. Great. Glad you're here. Um, Elle, hello. Hi, Stephanie. Can you hear me now? Yes, I can. Uh, loud and clear. Okay. How are you? I'm just so excited now <laughs> to, because... I think uh, you live in New York, right? Yes, I do. And are you alert for the storm coming? Yes. Me um, too. <laughs> yep, we, uh, we are going to get some food today. We might go out today, um, but then tomorrow um, it's supposed to start snowing, I think, at 5 a.m. or 6 a.m., oh, okay. and... Yeah, I'm going to stay inside all day. Um, you too, right? Yeah. <laughs> um, yeah, I actually, I have a class on Saturdays, um, and that was canceled. So I might actually be teaching on Verbling instead. Um, you don't have to travel. <laughs> yeah, yeah, it's nice. I can stay yeah, indoors. Yeah, so convenient. <laughs> yeah. Um, and do you have to go anywhere this weekend? Uh, I don't think so. <laughs> Because of, yes, it's so dangerous to to go outside now. Now people stay in the house now. Yeah, yeah. Um, we we all should if we can. Yeah. So good, good. Um, and Santiago, hello. Hello, Stephanie. How are you today? I'm good. How are you? I'm doing well. Thank you for asking. Good, good. Um, all right. Glad you're here. Um, so welcome everyone. Uh, we will get started. This is called Friends Pronunciation Through Acting. Um, and this is a pronunciation class where we focus on um, areas of pronunciation that can be um, more difficult to practice. Uh, so intonation uh, and special emphasis, um, stress, word stress, sentence stress, uh, rhythm, also, reduced speech and connected speech, so how words actually sound when they are together. Um, and we do that by acting out scenes from the television show Friends. 
Um, is everyone here familiar with the TV show Friends? Yes. Yes. Is there anyone who has never heard of? What? What? <laughs> I have to be honest. And it's pretty famous. Um, it's been translated into many languages. Um, but if you have never seen it, uh, you don't need to. Um, you don't need to have a knowledge of the show to benefit from the pronunciation. That will do. Uh, so let's get started um, and look at today's scene. We have two short scenes, actually. Um, <clears throat> okay, first, uh, just a quick intro. If you are not familiar with the show, there are six characters. Phoebe, Joey, Monica, Ross, Rachel, Chandler. Um, those are the six main characters, uh, the friends. Uh, and they live in New York and have crazy adventures. Our scene today, uh, I'm going to get a link to share this with you. And you can find that link in the chats. Um, so you can have the script open. First, we're going to read a little bit about the episode. Um, and then we'll actually watch the scene before we perform. Uh, the first scene has four characters, which is perfect, because there are four of you. Um, but let's start. Let's have someone read this. This is a summary of the episode. Um, Monica, would you want to read that for us? OK. Friends, the one uh, where the monkey gets away. Rachel finds out Barry is engaged to Mindy, her former bridesmaid. She begins to show interest in dating again, so Ross decide, decides to ask her, her out. However, before he gets the chance, she loses muscle while mon monkey is sitting, which temporarily drives a wage between them. While looking for muscle, Joy and Chandler meet some hot girls, Samantha and Tia, with a broken radiator. Ross and Rachel finally sit down for some wine, but before Ross can ask Rachel out, Barry barks in, saying he is still in love with her. Excellent. Thank you, Monica. Um, excellent. So, Marcel is the monkey, Ross is monkey, um, and basically, our first scene is this. Um, so they're looking for Ross's monkey, and Joey and Chandler meet some hot girls. Um, that's going to be our first scene. Let me say hello, Mustafa. Welcome. Yes, hello. Now, how are you today? I'm doing well. Good, good. Welcome to class. Glad you're Welcome here. Welcome to. Okay. Um, and Ken, hello. Yes, hello. How are you? I'm good. How are you? Yes, I'm fine. Thank you. Good. Welcome to class. Glad you're here. Um, okay, so we're going to get started with our first scene. There are four characters, Chandler, Joey, uh, woman number one, and woman number two, somewhere down here. Um, we will perform it a couple times so that... Um, so all six of you can uh, perform. Uh, we'll switch up roles. But first, let's watch the clip. Um, you will need to open the YouTube app. Um, in your Hangout, you should see the YouTube app. Hopefully you are familiar with this. Uh, we're going to watch all together in the YouTube app. And then we'll start uh, working on the scene. All right, here we go.
Um, okay, was everyone able to see the clip? Yes. Yes. <laughs> All right. Uh, great. So that's our scene, a uh, funny scene. Um, I think we are, we're going to, how do I want to do this? We're going to go over, let's just read through. Actually, no, we'll cast parts and we'll practice pronunciation as we go through. Um, and we'll take questions about any vocabulary or jokes or anything um, as we go through. So let's have, we're going to have two performances. Um, in our first performance, Ken and L will be Chandler and Joey. Okay, so Ken and L will be Chandler and Joey. Um, Monica, you'll be Woman One. And Mustafa, you'll be Woman Two. Okay, that's performance one. Um, then in the second performance, Santiago <coughs> will be Chandler, and Salvatore will be Joey. Um, so we'll just kind of reverse order. Let's try it this way. Um, <clears throat> now, we're going to go through the lines, um, and I'm going to have you read your own lines, but I recommend everyone to practice all the lines. Um, that way you'll benefit more from this class. Just keep your mic on mute when it's not your turn. Um, but practice the lines. Um, all right. The scene starts. Chandler and Joey are just saying, Marcel, Marcel. Okay. Uh, looking for the monkey. So we're going to start with woman number one's line. So Monica, will you start for us? Uh oh, Monica, I can't hear you. Hmm. Can everyone hear me? Yes, I can. Yes. Okay, sometimes there's a problem on my end. Um, okay, Monica, you might need to refresh your browser or the, the scene. Um, let's have uh, Mustafa, will you read this? Line, you'll be doing that line in the second scene. So. Okay. Hi, can I help you? Good, good. And um, we're going to shorten can is going to sound a little more like Ken. Um, this is sound like, hi, can I help you? Mm -hmm. Hi, can mm -hmm. I help you? Great, sounds really good. A monkey? Um, a monkey? A, mon a monkey? Uh, all right, let's see. Then um, Chandler, that's you, Ken. Will you read the next line? Mm, we're kind of having an emergency, and we 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 were looking for something. Good. Um, we already have this reduction, we're, instead of we are. Uh, but another common reduction, when we say kind of, a lot of times it's going to sound like kind of. Um, the G, we don't pronounce too, too clearly. So let's do this little yeah. phrase. Um, we're kind of having an emergency. We're kind of having an emergency. Nice. Um, and then and is going to reduce to N. Or is going to sound like fur. So this part will sound like and we we were looking for something. And we, we were looking for something. 
Beautiful. Sounds great. Thank you. Um, L, you're our first yes. joke. Okay. A monkey. A monkey. Great. Uh, easy. <laughs> yes. Uh, have you seen any? <laughs> oh, this one is for Ken. Ken. Actually, yeah, let's have, um, wait a second. We Sorry. have two Chandlers, so why don't I have Santiago do this one? Yes, I'm a uh, woman one. <laughs> but you okay. should, that was good practicing though, Mustafa. Do practice all the lines. <laughs> Everyone <laughs> should be practicing all the lines. Um, all right, Santiago, go ahead. Okay. Uh, Jess, have you seen any? Great. Um, let's speed this up. This pronoun you is often shortened to ya or even y. Have you seen any? Yes. Have you seen any? Very nice. Very nice. And let's just do that little phrase one more time. Have you seen any? Have you seen any? Very nice. Have you seen any? Okay. Very nice. Sounds good. Thank you, Santiago. Um, and let's have Monica, your woman one for no, our first... I'm a woman one. Yes, Mustafa, you are woman one in... This is confusing, but <laughs> you are woman one in our second performance. Monica is woman one in our first performance. Um, don't worry, I have it all on a paper, um, and I'll tell you when. <laughs> Um, it's a little mixed up with our. Uh, I, I made the first one. I, I made the first one. Hi, can I help you? Yes. The thing is, we have two of each character. So right now, when we're practicing, um, I'll have you both practice. Um, okay. So you'll you'll both be woman okay. one. <laughs> Sorry, it is confusing. Um, Monica, you're back. Let's see if your sound is working. Hello? Monica, are you there? No, oh, no, your sound is still not working. All right, so we will, <laughs> Mustafa. <laughs> we will just have you be our only woman one. Sounds like Monica's tech is not working. All right, Mustafa, will you read our line for us, please? Okay. No, no, I haven't seen monkey. Do you know, do you know anything about fixing radiators? Good, good. Um, let's see, this first one sounded pretty good. Haven't seen a monkey. Let's do this question. Uh, do you know is going to reduce. It's going to sound kind of like, do you know? Uh, do you do you know? You do you know. know anything? Do you know anything about fixing radiators? Good, good. And then the stress on this word falls on the first syllable. Um, so, do you know anything about fixing radiators? Do you know anything about fixing radiators? Very nice. Um, excellent speed on that. Thank you. All right, let's have radiators our. Radiators is uh, uh, air condition. Oh, um, yes, the heater, actually, heat. Heater, heater. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So let's get a good, we're already in Google Images. This is a good word for, typically, you wouldn't know that in, in your second language. So, good word. Um, excellent. Let's have our second Joey. That is Salvatore. Will you read this line? Sure, sure. Did you, you, did you try turning the knob back the other way? Very nice, nice, nice intonation on that question. Um, let's do did you. This is so common in English. Um, native speakers often, when the D and the Y come together, it almost sounds like a J in there. Did you, did you. So let's try just those two words together. Did you? Did you? Did you? Did you? Good, good. And then let's put it together. Did you try turning the knob? Did you try turning the knob? Very nice. And that G kind of falls away. 
and then let's put it all together. Did you uh, did you try turning the knob back the other way? Did you? Oh my God! Did you? Did you try turning the knob back the other way? Excellent, excellent. Yeah, it's not an easy sound. <laughs> Great job, Salvatore. Uh, and hopefully everyone else was practicing as well. Um, back to woman one, and that's you, Mustafa. It looks like Monica's gone. So. Of course. Perfect. Um, let's have... Al, will you do this one? Oh, then no. <laughs> Good. Ah. No comments on that one. Perfect. All right, woman number two. Uh, we don't have any woman number two anymore. So I, I'll read this line. Taste this daiquiri. Did I, did I put too much run in here? It was bad. Okay. Uh, Mustafa, back to you. Um, number two. Just to see. Is that just to see? Uh, hope you find your monkey. Good, good. Yep. Um, and this is sec, short yeah, for second. Just, um, just a sec. Yep. Good. That sounds good. Just a sec. Just a sec. Uh, Hmm. Hope you find Hope your monkey. Um, hope you find your monkey. Yeah, good. Your shortens to your. Very nice. Hope you find your monkey. Hope you find your monkey. Great. Your monkey. Great. That sounds good. Really good, Mustafa. Um, thank you. Let's go back to Ken for Chandler's next line. Okay. Oh. Mm, no, no, wait, 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 no, no. Uh, we may not know anything about radiators per, per se, but we do have a certain amount of expertise in the heating and cooling uh, milieu. <laughs> Excellent. Um, so Chandler is trying to impress the hot ladies uh, by sounding smart for some reason. Um, so he uses these words per se. This phrase comes to us from Latin, uh, meaning in itself, something like that. This word comes to us from French, and I honestly would have to look it up. So we'll look that word up. But it is pronounced milieu. 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 And it is a person's social environment. Okay, environment, background, atmosphere, context. All right, so there's our word of the day. <laughs> um, let's see, something to work on with pronunciation. Um, let's just work on this phrase. Let's see, ah. Here's what we have. A special use of the auxiliary do. Um, he's using do here to create contrast. Here's a negative, um, but he wants to emphasize the positive, what, what they do have. And I just did it, trying to explain it. Uh, so special emphasis there. Um, so this phrase, and then we're going to shorten... We just have a lot of prepositions and uh, conjunctions, so it's going to feel very fast. But let's just focus on this phrase. Um, but we do have a certain amount of expertise in the heating and cooling milieu. We, um, sorry, but we do have a certain amount of expertise in heating and cooling milieu. Nice, nice. That's a mouthful. Um, sounds good. All right, let's go back to Joey. I think it's Salvatore, your turn again. Oh, aren't, aren't we kind of in the middle of something here? Great, great. Um, this 
we already see that it's reduced. Uh, we've reduced it to aren't. But I want you to reduce it even further. Only one syllable, aren't. Uh, it's going to sound like this, aren't. Uh, are. Yeah, this is a good one for everyone to practice. Uh, we do this a lot. Um, so aren't will become aren't, and it's going to sound like, oh, kind of, always is, almost always is going to sound like kind of. So this will sound like, aren't we kind of in the middle of something here? Uh, aren't we kind of in the middle of something? something here. Very nice, very nice. Uh, I would say even this of gets reduced to just a schwa sound. Uh, uh. Uh, uh, Aren't uh, we kind of in the middle of something here? Aren't we kind of in the middle of something here? Great, great. This is a mouthful. Very <laughs> nice. Good reductions. Um, back to Chandler and Santiago. It is your turn for the Chandler line. Okay. Uh, yes, but these women are very hot, and they need our help, and they they are very hot. Good, good. Um, we don't have much to do with this sentence. Just um, the conjunction and is going to sound like and. n. Okay. Um, and then this, we want just one syllable. They are should sound exactly like there yeah, and yeah. there. All three of these sound exactly the same. There, there, there. Um, let's reduce this and. will also be n. Uh, so let's do... Um, yes, but these women are very hot and they need our help. And they're very hot. Okay. Uh, yes, but these four women are very hot, and they need our help, and they're very hot. Wonderful. Very good. Very good. All right, back to Joey, and it is L. Your turn for Joey. Okay. Uh, we we can't. All right. Well, sorry. You have no idea how sorry, but we promised. We find this mon. We find this monkey. If if you see him, he's about yeah high high and answer to the name Mar Marcel. So if we could get some pictures of you, you really be helping us out. Great, thank you. Al. very nice. Um, and this is the big joke of the scene. <laughs> um. All right, a lot going on here is kind of a big line. Um, let's look at just a couple things to focus on. Um, one thing, I want to practice this little phrase. Um, the H is going to fall off that pronoun. This will just sound like, if you see him. If you see him. Very nice. Uh, this... This word um, should sound like yay. Oh, yeah. This is very uncommon, but sometimes we say, I don't want to say very uncommon, but we say yay high when we're physically gesturing the height yeah. of a person <laughs> or a thing. Uh, and then let's see, we're going to reduce that preposition to, almost always gets reduced to just a t or a t. Um, and then let's reduce of even. It might sound like pictures of you. Pictures of you. Pictures of you. Um, so let's do just this sentence. It's a long sentence. Oh, also, I'll note this name we pronounce as if it is French. So we say Marcel. Um, Marcel different irregular pronunciation. All right, so this sentence, let's go. It's, if you see him, he's about yay high and answers to the name Marcel. So if we could get some pictures of you, you'd really be helping us out. If you see him, 
It's about your hands and answer to the to the names of Marcel. So if we could, so if we could get some pictures of you, you will, you really be helping us out. Very nice, very nice. It's a long sentence. Um, great job, nice job tackling it. Um, and let's head back to Chandler. Ken. Okay. From now on, you don't get to talk. Uh, you don't get to talk to other people. Good. Yeah. Let's. Um, we're gonna reduce. Hopefully, you're starting. Everyone's starting to notice patterns. That preposition two is almost always reduced. Um, and let's do just this phrase. Uh, also, actually, I think we have a case of special emphasis here. He's a little bit angry, and he's being uh, trying to express that to Joey. So he's okay. From now on, you don't get to talk to other people. Okay. From now on, you don't get to talk to other people. Very nice, very nice. Good speed there at the end to talk to other people. Um, all right, and that's really our last line. Um, Joey and Marcel at the end, you will say, Marcel, and you'll say it in an angry way, right? They're angry now that they have to look for the monkey. All right, um, so let's see. Monica, welcome back. Hi, is it Hello. working? Yes, it is. Uh, yeah. Okay. okay. Um, I think what we'll do, since I think we will perform this scene three times, so that Mustafa and Monica can have be Chandler or Joey, too. Um, and it goes pretty fast once we're performing. So we will perform this three times. Um, and I think I want to watch it one more time so you can all hear kind of the changes. Uh, the best thing now is to read the script and listen to the friends. Okay, so everyone, we're going back to the YouTube app one more time. Um, everyone pay attention to your role. Uh, Monica and Mustafa. Let's have Monica, you'll be Chandler. Mustafa, you'll be Joey. So pay attention to their parts. Um, okay, let's open the YouTube app and watch one more time. If I can get it to play. I have to add it again. No. Just a moment, I need to re-add it.
All right, everyone. Um, so we got to hear it one more time. Here's some of those changes I've pointed out. Um, I do think, I really don't think you put special emphasis there. Uh, I heard more emphasis on other people. So let's maybe emphasize other people. Um, okay, are there any questions on this scene before our performances? <laughs> All right, so we are going to perform. Uh, again, we'll do it three times. So performance one, Ken, your Chandler. L, your Joey. Monica, woman one. Mustafa, woman two. Okay? Places, okay. please. Uh, lights, <coughs> camera, and action. Marcel. 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 Hi, can I help you? Uh, we're kind of having an emergency, and we, we were looking for something. A monkey. Yes. Have you seen any? No. No, haven't seen any, a monkey. Do you know anything about fix, fixing radiator? Sure, sure, sure. Did, did you uh, did you try turning the knob back the, the other way? Of course. Oh, then no. Uh, test this uh, the query. Did I put too much RAM in here? Just a sec. Hope you find your monkey. Oh no 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 wait, no no. Uh, we may not and know anything about uh, red areas per se, but we do have a certain amount of expertise and uh, this in the, the heating and cooling. Me do. Uh, are we kind? kind of in the middle or something here? Yes, but these women are very hard and they need our help. They are very hard. We, okay, we can't, all right. We're sorry. You have no idea how sorry. But we promise we find th this monkey. If you see him, he's about, yeah, highs and answer to the name's muscle. So if we could get some piece to some pictures you you really be helping us out okay from now on you don't get it talking to other people Marcel Marcel and very nice scene um, great <laughs> sounding good um, Everyone was right on the ball with that one. Um, no waiting, nothing. Good work, actors. Um, a couple of notes. Um, a lot of the reductions are sounding good up here. Oh, yeah, I want to note um, when we reduce and, um, there still is a little bit of a vowel sound. There is a schwa sound. So it should sound like N, or like the name of the letter. N. So we're having an emergency and we, we were looking for something. Um, there is a little bit of a vowel sound. Um, let's see, really good on the did ya, did ya, did ya, sounded good. Um, great. Any questions or comments? Group one. No. <laughs> All right, let's head down. We're going to perform it a second time. Uh, this time, Monica, you're Chandler. Mustafa, you'll try Joey. Salvatore, woman one. Santiago, woman two. Places, please. And, oh, and I forgot. We didn't go over this line. This is daiquiri. Daiquiri. Um, all right, so places, please, and lights. 
camera, action. Marcel? 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 Hi, can I help you? Mm, we're kind of having a, an emergency and we were looking for something. A monkey? Yes, uh, have you seen any? No, no, haven't seen a monkey. Did you know anything about fixing radiators? Sure, sure. Did you, uh, uh, did you try uh, turning the knob back the other way? Of course. Oh, then no. Taste this decorate. Did I put too much RAM in here? Just a sec. Hope you find your monkey. Oh, no, no, no. Wait, wait, no. Um, we may not know anything about radiators per se, per se, but we do have a certain amount of expertise in the heating and cooling video. Uh, 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 aren't, where are you? Yes, aren't we, uh, aren't we kind uh, in the middle uh, something here? Yes, but these women are very hot and they need our help. And they're very hot. We can't write. We're sorry. Uh, you have no idea how sorry, but we promised we'd find uh, this monkey. If you see, um, uh, he's about uh, yeah, hi, and answered uh, the name, Marcel. So if we could get some uh, pictures, uh, you, uh, you'd really be helping us out. Okay, from now on, you don't get to talk to other people. Marcel? Marcel. And scene! Excellent! Uh, very good, very good. Um, I notice, I think, the most natural reduction is the of. Um, everyone's doing a really nice job reducing of to just a. Uh. So, that's a very common reduction. Great job! One more performance, uh, and in this time, let's see, I forgot who was who. Santiago, are you Chandler or Joey? Well, uh, the last time I was woman number two, so I only say one sentence. Yeah, I, I was going to have you be, let's see, Salvatore. Let's just go. I forgot what I said. But Salvatore, you are going to be Chandler. Santiago, you will be Joey. Joey. Okay. Uh, Ken, you are woman one. And L, you are woman two. Everyone ready? Places, yes. please. And lights, camera, action. Marcel? 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 Hi, can I help you? Mm, we're kind of having an emergency. We, we were looking for something. A monkey. Yes, have you seen it, Henny? Uh, no, no, I haven't seen any monkey. I haven't seen a monkey. Do you know, do you know anything about fixing radiators? Sure, sure. Did you uh, did you try turning the knob back the other way? Of course. Oh, then no. Test this, the curry. Did I put too much uh, rum in here? Just a sec. Hope you find you your monkey. Oh, no, no, wait, 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 no, no, oh, we may not know anything about radiators per se, but we do have a certain amount of expertise in the heating and cooling milieus. Oh, are we kind of in the middle of something here? Yes, but these women are very hot. Need they need her help. Need they very hot. We can't arrive. Very, very sorry. 
you have no idea how sorry, but we promise we'd find this monkey. If you see him, if you see him, he's about, yeah, hi and answers the name, the name, Marcel. So if we could get some pictures of you, you'd really be helping us out. Okay, from now on, you don't get to talk to other people. Marcel? Marcel? <laughs> and scene! Um, great, great job, Santiago and Salvatore um, as our leads. Um, great job, everyone. Uh, again, I think of is probably the easiest reduction. Uh, if I were to give everyone one reduction to practice more, it would be the N and sounding like N. Uh, make sure there is a vowel. I do want it to have a vowel sound. Uh, heating and cooling. Heating and cooling. Um, but great. Sounded nice, everyone. Any last comments or questions on this scene? I have a question. Yeah. Uh, uh, milieu, this word is very common? No. <laughs> <laughs> it is very uncommon. Um, this is very academic, very, this would be a very smart word. And the exact meaning of this word is? Um, it is, I had to look it up because I don't know it myself, but it is a person's social environment. Uh, Okay. Um, okay. Yes, yeah, so you can use it in place of environment, background, atmosphere. Okay. Um, it's you. a great word, very uncommon, very smart. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Good question. Anyone else? Any other questions? We do have one more quick scene. It's really short, so I think uh, our time is short, but I still think we can uh, get something out of this next scene. Um, we have four characters, again, um, but pretty equal speaking, I guess. Monica has the most parts. Um, we'll just do this scene. We'll get out of it what we can. We may only have one one time each. Let's have, oh boy, let's just uh, watch it first and then we'll we'll just kind of read through, okay? Uh, so let's do one more, one more time to the YouTube app. Uh oh, my YouTube app is gone. I have to add it again, I guess. This is very strange. I just want to do this scene so that one of you has to do Phoebe's line at the end. <laughs> um, <laughs> no, it's a fun scene, very short. Um, I'm going to assign parts and we'll just r run through once um, and then we'll maybe switch parts and run through again. Um, let's have Monica be Monica. Um, yeah for convenience. <laughs> um, and let's give uh, Mustafa, why don't you be Chandler for this one? Okay. All right. Uh, Salvatore, we're going to give you Joey. And Santiago, you get to be Phoebe. 
Um, all right, let's just try it uh, just how it is. Get ready. Lights, camera, action. This is me in the sound of music. See the band truck kids? Nope. nope. That's because I'm in front of them. Oh, I thought that was an out. Well, high school was not my favorite time. I do know. I loved high school. You know, for years of parties and dating and sex. Yeah, well, I went to boarding school with 400 boys and sex I had wouldn't involve a major lifestyle choice. Gosh, doesn't, doesn't it seem like a million years ago? Ow, 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 my, my butt, uh, my butt cheek is waking up, ow, oh, ow. Oh. <laughs> and scene, excellent. Um, this is just a funny little scene. Thank you all for performing that for us. Um, uh, let's just do a couple, are there questions? Any questions on the language or the jokes? Vocabulary. Yes, uh, Stephanie. I don't remember uh, what is do no. Ah, good. I'm glad you asked. Um, this is how we reduce don't know. Don't know. Okay. So when I say I don't know, it's gonna sound like I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. Uh, it reduces quite a bit. Almost unrecognizable. Do you know it's correct? Pronounce cor do no, right, teacher? Um, do no. You don't want to ooh, try a uh, duh, I don't know. Um, or even, there's almost no vowel there. Just a very, it's a schwa. If you can put a schwa in there, they need to learn how to do a schwa symbol. Do know. Yeah. Yeah, do know. I don't know. Um, in fact, my advice would be, don't worry about that vowel and just add lots of extra stress over here. I don't know. I don't know. Okay. Yeah, good question. Um, other questions? All right. There is. There are a few pronunciation things we could do. Um, just want to point out that this one is very, very common. So is this one. You know? You know? Um, and I guess that's about it. Uh, we, we don't, ah, uh, I don't know. We uh, have time. I have, yeah, I have go a ahead. question. Uh, trapped kids? Oh, this is from, um, Von Trapp is the last name of the children in this play. Uh, okay. Yeah. Good question. All right. Why don't we do one more? I think we can squeeze in one more quick one. Let's have uh, Ken. Would you be Monica? Okay. L, you'll be Phoebe. Okay. Uh, Salvatore, you'll be Chandler. And Santiago, you're Joey. Okay. Final performance. Lights, camera, action. This is me, the sound of music. See the Bond Trap kids? Nope. That's because I'm in front of them. Huh? I thought that was an ad. I forgot who I assigned Chandler. I think it's Salvatore. Oh, can you? Okay. Hey, I thought that was an alp. Well, high school was not my favorite time. I don't know. I loved high school. 
you know, it was just for four years of parties and dating and sex. Yeah. Well, I went to boarding school with 400 boys. I had good involved a major lifestyle choice. Gosh, that seems like a million years ago. Oh, oh, oh. My, my, butt, cheek, my butt cheek is waking up. Oh, oh. And scene. <laughs> Excellent. Uh, this would be even more fun in person. We could do some physical acting as well. But uh, thank you, everyone. I'm sorry, we are right up to the last minute. We have to say a quick goodbye. Um, but thank you for joining me. And I'll be here uh, continuing this class for the next month. OK, thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Bye, bye, everyone. Thanks for joining. Bye. Take bye. care. Bye, bye. Bye, work.